Hi, I'm Oscar from Kim Paintball, and I'm going to be giving you a review on the <gasps> Planet Eclipse Etha. I'm going to get out of the way so you can properly see it. And this is the Etha 1, not the Etha 2, normal Etha. No. For is this gun kid friendly? I give it a 2. Just because just, just I do. Deal with it. <laughs> uh, wait. This is really light. I mean, cameraman, get over here. E e is it light? Yes. Screw. Okay. Next, so that's why I gave it a four. Comfort. I really like it. The front grip's good, except for there's a little bead right here. You can kind of see it, the silver thing. When you go to hold it, it like feels weird on your hand because the way I hold it, I go like that and I shoot. Other than that, it's good. There's, it's not quite as comfortable as the rise because the handle's all chipped out. But I kind of like the rise because I use it. <laughs> um, next one, overall design. Is this a new gun, old gun, or modern gun? By new and old, I mean like M2 Lux, um, and like Bobong, like the new stuff. That's what I mean by new, like M2s and. Luxes, Lux Ice, Lux OLED, whatever you want to call it. And by old stuff, I mean, one second, Wall of Fortune, old stuff. Auto Cocker, old, old. Free, go say to your parents if they played paintball. Do, do you, you probably used the Auto Cocker back when you were well, still old. Put that. No, I'm, I'm just not gonna put that on there in case it falls. <sighs> so that's why I gave it a three because it's like in between, kind of. <laughs> so next, do do do. Bolt design. That means, like, when you go to take your bolts out. How well can you, do you know where all the O-rings are? Do you know how to take it apart? Is there a manual? Are there color-coded O-rings of where to go? And I give it a one. A one. That's how sad the bolt.